Excel Ninja. Hey y'all, Excel Ninja here. Today we're going to talk about trimming white space out of a cell. So sometimes you have cells and you may want to summarize the data, group it, and it looks to be the same, but then when you go to group it or do a pivot table, it doesn't actually group up correctly. So there's a couple things you can do. First, you can test to see if that white space is hiding in there. A great way of doing that is to use a formula that will show the length of the cell. So equals LEN that, enter. Let me copy that down. As you can see, there is a cell. It says it's four characters, but it says dog. You say, well, that's three characters. Well, yes, but if you hover over the cell and you hit F2, see how the cursor is blinking a space out from there, well, no problem. You can hit backspace and boom, you've gotten rid of that white space. But what if you have a ton of cells that you need to do this to? Well, that's not really practical to go through and edit each cell individually, correct? So we'll put it in two of the cells. So what you do is you do a trim function in order to chop out the extra space. It will chop the beginning and the ending space, but not affect anything in the middle. So we'll say new value, and then we'll say equals trim. And we go to that, and I hit enter. Copy that formula down. Okay. And now let's test out the number of characters on the new value. Equals len. The length of parentheses is the cell. Hit enter three. So as you can see with the new formula, we trim it out equals trim in the cell you want to trim and hit enter. Now, after you're all said and done with that, you could do you could highlight everything, do a right click copy, right click paste special values, and boom. Your new cell is there. Hey, thanks for visiting. Be sure to subscribe.